In these games on the water, Canada has been utterly dominant. Rowers scooping up three more gold medals today. Canada's men's eight pulling away in this race. Many of Canada's athletes are saying loudly that competing at home in front of enthusiastic fans is giving them an edge. And most importantly, the city of St. Catharines, the city of St. Catharines was huge. Yeah. I could hear them when I was coming through that bottom 500 meters. And I was so hungry, I just went woof, 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 and we went for it. Ellie Black went for it too today. With the crowd's help, she overcame fatigue and picked up her fourth and fifth medals of the games, both gold. To just come in here and be able to do that in front of the home crowd, having everyone's support is incredible. But Team Canada's superb start comes after years of work, a determined and coordinated effort to get better results, tracing back to the Vancouver Olympics. Looks like Smith, it is Kira Smith gold, Martha McKay but Canada gets the silver. Athletes in Canada believe they can win, they want to win, and they are winning. That's the new culture of excellence that we've seen since we hosted the Games in 2010. Cuba! One bit of controversy today, news that four Cuban rowers have defected. They are already in the United States. But the story of these games so far is the success of Canada's athletes. A lot of people don't realize that, you know, this is, this is the fun part. This is when we finally get to show off a little bit and win. And winning, they are. Howard Gould, CBC News, Toronto.